it's Tiffany. I am here with a very exciting video. So we have a full case of the new mini brand series too. I want to thank Zuru for sending this whole case to me for free to open up with you guys today. I'm so, 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 so excited. I, I love mini brands. I know you guys love mini brands. Mini brands are amazing. So we have this display case right here. Oh, before I go any further, these are hitting shelves in the USA and Canada September 14th and on. So keep your eyes peeled. They're coming to a store near you very soon. <laughs> so this display case, we have a little preview here. A little, 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 little fun preview. There's Lunchables, ground cinnamon, bagel bites, jello, and feta cheese. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. I think these these display ones, like the cinnamon, the Lunchables, and the jello one, my favorite so far. I cannot wait to check out the list as well. So let's start opening up this entire case, you guys. I cannot wait. Oh my goodness. So there's three, six, nine, twelve. So there's 24 capsules total in this case. And I almost forgot. We got to grab our little shopping cart that I love to use. This is actually a um, My Life As shopping cart. I bought it at Walmart. It's a perfect size. You can't really see it too, too much, but that's what I'm going to use to store our stuff. I've, you've seen it in my other mini brands videos, but anyway, <laughs> I'm so excited. So there's 70 plus minis to collect. We have all new packaging. So this is a gold, a shiny gold packaging. I'm loving it, of course. And it doesn't really say anything otherwise. Now let's just go ahead and hop into this so that we can check out the checklist and obviously see which ones we're going to get as well. So this is the same, you know, we have the first layer of wrapping and then we have this layer and it looks like this is recyclable as well, which is great. That's good to know. Um, cause this is a lot of plastic, a lot of, <laughs> a lot of capsules. Um, so anyway, you pop this open here and then you get five little sections and each little section has a surprise inside. I really wanted to find the one with the list in it first. Oops, I broke it off. I don't know which one has the list in it though. So we're just gonna have to go with it. So let's see what's in this first one. We got the bagel bites. So the ones that were on the front, uh, in the front of the display case, it's a little actual cardboard, little box of bagel bites. Now, Last time you could actually like read the ingredients and you still can't you could still you could read everything This is all printed on exactly as you would find it on the real thing. Love it <laughs> Then the next one we have Garlic and herbs a little box. This is a uh, little cardboard box as well Super cool and you can't technically open them I guess I'm gonna leave mine closed though and then, so any duplicates we get, we're gonna throw in the cart. We're gonna keep everything new out here. So here's the checklist, but let's see what we got. We got some bullseye barbecue sauce. So this is a plastic container, a little, or well, not a container, this is just plastic. <laughs> Super cute. And then, oh, Kool-Aid, it's tropical punch Kool-Aid. Oh my gosh, this one's my favorite so far, I think. This is so cute, and this is again a plastic. I'll try to let you guys know if it's like a cardboard or container or whatever kind of material it is. Did I open all of these already? No, wait, we're missing one. Where's the other capsule? Oh, here it is. It's hiding from me. All right, and last one we have is the Blue Diamond Almonds. Oh my goodness. This is so cute. Oh my gosh. All right, let's check out the list like we've all been wanting to do for the past however long it's been since I started this video. So we have the collector's guide. I should get a little pen so I could check them off as I go. I still haven't completed the series one. I really wanted to do a whole series one collection video, but I never got around to it. So, whoops, <laughs> I still am working on it. We're, I'm missing a bunch of the, the super rare ones. But for this time around, we have a bunch of super rare ones. We have a tomato, uh, Heinz ketchup. We have one of the almonds. We have a baby baby bell cheese. It looks like French's mustard, and oh, the the is that soy, steak sauce, soy sauce, whatever. Um, and then we have a glow in the dark almond breeze. I love this. Is this the chocolate milk? That's the chocolate milk. I get almond breeze chocolate milk all the time. And that that one's rare. And then more rares. We have metallics. We have Old Bay seasoning. Uh, what is that? Uh, is that? Oh. Baby Bell cheese? I think so. 
<laughs> I don't really eat cheese. Um, and then we have Nutri Thins. Why is it Nutri Thins? Nut, nut Thins. Um, those are the almond ones, Bagel Bites, and Miracle Whip. So then we have the actual list here. Um, oh my gosh, look at that. That's a Country Time Lemonade. So we have Commons. Oh, there's Cool Whip. Oh my gosh, I'm not, I'm not even going to be able to go through all these. There's pickles, sauce. Oh my goodness. Okay. Lots of, oh look, it's a macaroni and cheese, macaroni and cheese. There's sh shredded cheddar. Oh my goodness. Okay, and then we flip it around. <laughs> oh goodness. And then there's dressings. There's like Velveeta, oh, Orida fries, and Maxwell House coffee. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. There's so many good ones to collect this time around. Oh, and look, these are the new little containers. So we can get paper bags, which... I need all of them. I need all paper bags. I don't want anything else. Then we have this kind of shopping cart where the little basket can go inside the little shopping cart. And then we have one of these handheld cart things. And then I guess these ones are probably the collector's exclusive. I don't, wait, what's the collector's case exclusive? Just whatever has the little diamond. Oh, these ones. Okay, so like the coconut milk, this mustard, and this macaroni and cheese are the case exclusives. So anyway, then we can find like shelves and like this checkout thing. I don't know if we can find them in the capsules or if those are like exclusive to like the mini mart or whatever. So we'll have to figure that out. Anyway, let's keep going. I am so excited to open all of these up and find out what we've got. Like I just, I find something new every time I look at the checklist. But so far, the Kool-Aid is my favorite one we found. And we're just going to... I'll let you know when something <laughs> something better comes along in my mind. <laughs> They're all so amazing now. Alright, and then let's open up the capsules. So we have some blue diamond almonds. These are smokehouse flavored ones. We got another checklist, of course. And we got our first duplicate of the bullseye barbecue sauce. I'm going to go ahead and put that in our little shopping cart. And then, what is this? Oh, this is the little Baybel bit? No, it's the Laughing Cow. That's it. Goodness. I don't know my dairy products because, you know, I don't consume dairy products. <laughs> um, these are cheese dippers. And that's a little cardboard box. And then let's see what's in there. Oh, we got the Orada! These are the golden crinkled potato potatoes fries. <laughs> it says potatoes on it, that's why I've said that. Um, so it actually has, like... I wanted to say foam in it, but it kind of feels a little bit spongy, like it has a sponge in it. So you don't want to open this. I mean, you could open this if you wanted to, but um, it probably has like a little sponge. I'm actually curious. If I get a duplicate, maybe I'll think about opening it, but it's so cute. Oh my. And then pickles. So these are kosher dill, cloths and pickles. These are delicious. I love pickles. I think I opened all of them. Did I open? No, I missed one. Did I? Wait. <laughs> Two, four, five. Wait, no, I did miss one, didn't I? Wait a minute. Am I going crazy? No, we got one, two, three, four. Wait, where's the difference? No. I guess I lost it? What was it? I don't even know where it went or what happened. Hmm. That's weird. I think I'm just going crazy because I'm too excited. But anyway, let's check out the next one. Let's see if there was something. Because one, two, three, four, five, one, two, three, four. Yeah, I'm definitely, I definitely lost one. I don't know where it went or what, <laughs> what it was. Whoopsie. All right. So let's get this next one open. All right. And I'll pop it open and let's try not to lose them again. <laughs> First up, we have this this version of barbecue sauce. There's more barbecue sauce. Uh, you guys remember in series one how I always got tons of the soy sauce? I wonder what's going to be the soy sauce of this series. <laughs> oh, goodness. And then we have a duplicate. So this is our second duplicate of the Laughing Cow Cheese Dippers. And then we got another duplicate of the Bagel Bites Pizza Snacks. All right, so we have two more to open up here. Oh, Lunchables! So this is actually the pizza with pepperoni Lunchables, and it is a plastic container. I actually thought it would be like cardboard or something, but it is a plastic container. It looks so good. That's so awesome. I love it. 
last compartment in this one, we have obviously the collector's guide. See, I think I must have threw that last one with the collector's guide or something. I don't see it. Anyway, we have the Shake and Bake Original Pork. So we haven't even seen any of the um, accessories, I guess, yet, we could say. Um, before last, in the first season, I know it was kind of more of an error that in the first case that I opened up, they were just like constant, like shopping carts and baskets. So you can see they're a little bit more rare now, a little bit more hard to find. I really want to find the paperback, so I'm really hyped for those. I wonder what they're going to be like and how, what the size is going to be. And if they'll be able to hold more than one product or whatever. Alright, so next up we have, it seems like such a big box. Um, we have red beans and rice. Mm -mm -mm. That's just a little cardboard container. And we have, oh, the Old Bay seasoning. Awesome. And then, oh, we have, oh, no, no, no. This is our next duplicate. I thought it was the one in the display case, but this is one duplicate. All right. Next up. Oh, we have Classico tomato and basil sauce. I love it. It's so cool looking. You guys, these are such great little toys. I mean, for so many different other toys. Like, you could just play with them in themselves or play with them with so many other different toys. Oh, ooh, look at this. We got taco seasoning. Oh, my goodness. So, this also has, like, a little bit of the spongy thing going on inside just to give it a little bit of texture. Uh, but this is so awesome. This is just original taco seasoning. All right, so first row on the first row is done. <laughs> Let's keep going here. Oopsies. So excited. I just wish these would automatically open. <laughs> All right. The plastic seems to come off a lot easier, though. I will say that. All right. We have a duplicate of the beans, the boxed beans. And then this one, ooh, is chicken stock. Kitchen Basics chicken stock. It's just a little box. And then the next one. Ooh, we have some sort of seasoning. The crushed red pepper seasoning from McCormick. Awesome. It's like, oh, look, it's filled. And then you look at the bottom, it's like, ooh, it's empty. <laughs> All right. And then another Oh, we got a super rare! You guys, look, it's the blue diamond almond super rare! No way! Oh snap, you guys. Oh snap! I'm so excited! I want all the super rares. I want them all. This is so exciting. I didn't think I would get a super rare. Alright, so let's keep going and let's see what else we got. So this is the last one for this container. And we have the checklist. And we have zesty Italian dressing. Craft zesty Italian dressing. That's so super cool. I like the little Italian dressing. I think I like everything. So I think that's what we're just going to have to say. All right, let's move on to the next one. Oopsies. That tear strip did not want to work today. Let's see if I can get this open this way instead. But seriously, so cool. Still, still leading the pack is Kool Aid for me, for my favorites. Um, but also, the Orida fries and the golden one are super cool. And so is the dressing. So is the <laughs> Everything's so cool. All right, let's see. I'm going to try to complete this collection so that we can uh, do a collection video. Ooh, I should do like, I definitely need to finish series one really badly. But you guys better, if you got to finish series one, finish it now because as soon as these hit shelves, you're not going to be able to find Series 1 anymore. Okay, we had another duplicate. I feel like, obviously, the duplicates are going to start rolling in because, you know, we've opened so many so far. And, ooh, ooh, ooh. So this is just a rare, but it is a metallic one. It's the big white. Look at that. So all of the red in the background is metallic. Oh, I love it. I'm going to try to keep the rare ones in the center there. All right, wow, all right, I'm so excited. All right, ooh, we had the McCormick Pure Vanilla Extract. I actually have some of those in my pantry right now. <laughs> so awesome, that's just a little cardboard box. Then, two more uh, 
capsules in this capsule. Two more sections. <laughs> Alright, so we have the collector's guide. Then we have the craft sharp cheddar bag. So this again has like a tiny itty bitty bit of padding inside. So it gives it that texture. Oh, that's so cool. It even has a macaroni and cheese recipe on the back. <laughs> And then lastly, we have Laurie's Seasoned Salt. Awesome. Awesome. All right, let's move on to the next one. All right, we got the tear strip started. Let's see. Okay, good. We're back in the game. Back to working. So high. I'm surprised we still haven't seen any of the accessories, which I'm, I want to say I'm glad. I would rather have these than the accessories, like a lot of the accessories, you know? Uh, but let's, oh, we got the rare nut thins. <gasps> That's awesome. I'm so, I got, uh, this is crazy. This is awesome. Okay, so we got two rares and we got one super rare and it's only the first row. <laughs> And then we got a Lunchables. This is a duplicate. I was hoping, I wonder, did they do multiple Lunchables or is it just the pepperoni pizza one? Because I really want the like nacho one. Those were so, those were my jam, the nacho ones, whenever I was, I was like actually allowed to have some Lunchables. I don't know. I don't see them right off the bat on the list, but I'll keep, oh wait here. Now I only see the pizza one on there for now, so maybe in the future. Um, so anyway, next we have the Shake and Bake. Is Yeah, this is the same one, so we have a duplicate. And then, what's this one? Oh, it's a McCormick's or, uh, Gourmet, not organic. Well, it is organic, but it's a McCormick's Gourmet Organic Paprika. That's super cool. Ah! Uh, okay, I don't want to block my special ones. <laughs> and then we have, oh no, this one's like really... What's this? This is a big old bottle of red hot hot sauce. This is like a ginormous bottle compared to some of these. You know? <laughs> it's crazy awesome though. Okay, moving on. Oh my gosh, I was really hoping for this one. I actually hope for a few, uh, duplicate of this one. I definitely want to give it to my dad. This is actually the coffee that he drinks. That'd be so cool. Um, and then, oh, we got the Country Town Lemonade. I used to I used to drink this every once in a while. Oh my goodness, the pink lemonade version, that is. Oh, I love these ones, like the Kool-Aid and the little lemonade. They're so cool. Okay, everything's so cool. And then we have the A1 Steak Sauce, or the sauce. I think that's one of those. I don't use it, but <laughs> and then we have the Heinz sauce. Ooh, ooh! I didn't even see that one on the checklist. This is getting crazy. Finding new ones I didn't even know were on the checklist. Okay, and then this is actually like our first triplicate. This might be our new soy sauce. <laughs> Who knows? Into the cart it goes. All right, so we're on the last row of the first row. If that makes sense. There's three rows in each of the sections in each of the rows. So anyway, let's keep going here. Alright, let's see. Here's the little tear strip. Yeah. Oh, okay, what do we have in the first one? Kool-Aid! So it's a duplicate, but super excited for it. And then... Oh, ooh, Heinz Relish. I didn't even know this was on the checklist either. Ooh, awesome. And then this container has the Crystal Light Lemonade. So this is kind of has a little packet so you just add it to your really water bottle or whatever. That's awesome. A little cardboard box. And this one has the checklist as well as a duplicate. So we have Zesty Italian Sauce again or dressing. And the last capsule here, last section, we have a duplicate of the steak sauce, so we'll put that in our shopping cart. Moving on 
for this next one. Let's see what we got. Oh my goodness, I'm so, I'm still so hyped. I just want this case to never end. And even if I did get all of them, I still want to open more of these. These are just so super exciting. All right. We have the ground cinnamon. I was also really excited for this after I saw it right there on the front. And we have a French's crispy fried onions. Awesome. And then the country time lemonade again. So this is a duplicate for us. Two more. I'm actually really surprised we have not found one of the carts or bags or anything yet. Uh, then we have the stove top stuffing mix, little chicken flavored one. That's new for us. And we have one more compartment in this one, and it looks like it's some sort of sauce or dressing. And we have the bullseye barbecue sauce again. So it's I think it's a tie between this one and this for our most common one, <laughs> aka our soy sauce one. All right, let's get this next one open. I didn't want to come open. I feel like I'm a little cramped here with some of these. I gotta push some of them back. <laughs> All right, let's see. That might not be. Is that the? Oh no, here's the little tear. Shaking it, hearing all that fun stuff inside. All right, so we have our capsule open. Let's see what's in the first one. It looks like we have one of the shaken bakes again. Yep, the pork shaken bake. Then we have this, this one. Oh, this is the Lori Season Salt, so we're really rolling in the duplicates now. Let's see that. Yep, another duplicate for us. The red hot sauce. And I think we have two more capsules in here. And we got another duplicate. This might be our first all duplicate one. Let's see. Let's let's see if it is gonna be. Okay, ready? And it is, this was our first, our very first all duplicate capsule. We got the crystal light in there. All right, so this is our last capsule for the first row. And let's get this open. Can't believe we got our first all duplicate capsule. That was pretty funny. Okay, where's the little tear strip? Where is it? Oh, there it is. Super excited. I knocked something over. Whoopsies, it's fine. We'll just worry about that later. Oh, this capsule just came off. So let's open it first. We have, oh, Miracle Whip. Ooh, that's so cool. Got a new one for us. And then. Oh, we got this again. This one's winning for most common for sure. And then, oh, we got the original taco mix again. This is a duplicate. I definitely expect more so, these to be more so duplicates, duplicate, because we've gotten so many already. And then we have the nothing. I don't think we have the regular version of this, right? Yeah, we just have the super special one. So that's awesome. We got a new one. All right, this is our first capsule for the last row, you guys. Okay, Tear strip. I'm very, like I said before, very surprised about not seeing any of the little basket accessories yet anyway. I wonder if we're only gonna get like one per case. I don't know. Cool Whip, this is light Cool Whip. Look at that. Ooh, I love the little top. How we have all the examples of what we can use Cool Whip on. That's awesome. And then we have some Bagel Bites. This is a duplicate for us. Just regular Bagel Bites box. <gasps> Macaroni and cheese. <laughs> That's awesome, I love it. And then, oh, we got our first basket, I think. Let's open up the other capsule that we have here first and then we'll put together the basket. So we have another duplicate of the barbecue sauce. So this is, they're once again tied for <laughs> being most common. So with these, this is kind of crazy. All right, we got, I think instructions, I would assume. So we got one of these little baskets. 
and I'm gonna go ahead and put it together here. It should be fairly simple. Um, the other ones were very easy to put together, especially once you got the hang of it, once you kind of like really realized what was going on. Um, so I'm gonna try my best here to put this all together and then we'll get to see. Oh, should I put the bottom on? <laughs> I tried to follow the instructions, but you know, it's fine. Um, this, there we go, we got it, we got it. Everything's coming together, and then we'll put this last side on, and then we'll move to the front. This one, do we not, do we not get it in there? What's going on? <laughs> oh wait, I got it, I got it. All right, and then the front can go on. I don't know if the front needs to go inside here. Yes, it looks like it. And then we'll just snap it all together, like so. Alright, and then we have the handles. So we have this handle. I don't know if it like snaps in here or just slides. It just slides it looks like. And then we have the little handle, basket handle. Look at that. Awesome. And then this slides up. If you slide it up too far, obviously it's going to come back down or come all the way out. Then we have the little mini brands logo. So I'm going to put that here on the front. I don't know. We have two stickers, so I don't know if we get just an extra or what. But I just went ahead and put that on the front there. Now we do have another one, but it looks like there's only room for one on the front. So we're just going to go with that. That's awesome. I'm so excited. Let's see. And we can put our fries in there. <laughs> uh, but anyway, let me put that there. I'm just going to set this off to the back. All right, moving on. I'm excited we got to see that new accessory at least. I still, fingers crossed for the paper bags though. I don't know if we can find them in here. I'm, I'm just hoping. All right, tear strip. Oh, we got another thing. That's crazy. Okay, let me set that off to the side there. It's different. It's going to be the shopping cart this time. So we got a duplicate. We got the chicken stock. We have the ground cinnamon. So our cart's really filling up now. We have the stove top stuffing mix. And lastly, lastly, is this new? No, this is a duplicate as well. All right, so we got to put together our new accessory. Oh, no. I think I lost a piece. Where'd it go? <laughs> Where did it go? Oh, here it is. All right, so this cart is, um, we, let's see. I'll show you what the end piece looks like, this. All right. So we do have the little instructions here. I could try to do this without the instructions, though. I usually try it without. <laughs> All right, so let's actually put the handle, or yeah, I guess it's the handles on first. And then um, let's build, I guess, the basket. Um, so like the little yellow basket, which should be pretty much the same as um, the basket from season one. You guys should remember that one. All right, let's go ahead and put this in here. There we go. And then the next one, I think, am I, oh, no, I have that backwards. I was like, am I putting this in right? All right, so we have that. Very, very similar to the basket. Oh, I guess I should have put this in first. <laughs> Whoopsies, it's fine. Um, and then we'll just snap that into place. A little difficulty over here. Hmm. Are we in there? I think we're in. Um, so anyway. After that, we're going to go ahead and put this in, just holds there, and then I don't know where this goes. Uh, this goes, oh, it goes in the front, oh, 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 okay, so this slides in this way. Thank goodness for the instructions that we get, right? <laughs> I think I put it in wrong, <laughs> definitely. <laughs> Alright, so this goes here, so it kind of separates the two sections here and then you can use it like this or you can put your little basket in here this is awesome now for where you would put your sticker there's not a place on here but you can put your sticker here on the base i don't know how well that's gonna go let me actually where'd my where'd my other sticker sheet go because they're the same stickers i may as well use up one sticker sheet all right so let's try to get this on i guess i should have put it on before I put this together all right, I got it on there. It's a little crooked, but it's fine. All 
right, so that's cool. We got to see two of the accessories, the new accessories. All right, let's go ahead and open up the next one. Watch all of these <laughs> accessories in them or something. So I was just saying like how cool it is that they don't have them so commonly anymore. Uh, but anyway, let's see. Where is our little clear shirt? It's non-existent, so we're going to have to make it ourselves. Be careful using scissors, kids. All right. Okay, first capsule. Oh my gosh, no way. So we do, we are getting something new in every single one now. Okay, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna set that aside again. And I'm gonna open up the rest of them. So we have the Kool-Aid. Awesome. Then the Classico sauce again. So of course duplicates. Um, we have sharp cheddar cheese again. That is also a duplicate. Uh, I did all of those. And then we have this one. We have the A16 office <laughs> duplicate. Alright, so this next one, this next accessory, I wonder if we get like one of each accessory in the case. I don't know what the whole, whole thing is. This is actually really good to know because I was questioning on the list if we were able to get these in the capsules and we are. <laughs> so we got this shelf. So it seems pretty simple to put together. Let's go ahead and do this. Let's put, a go it looks like these shelves go in like this. And then we have another one. So we'll go in like this. Ta-da! And then it's time to put it all together. Oh, this one has wheels at the bottom too. That's cool. All right, so we're going to put this. I think we just snap it in here. I guess we were supposed to put the wheels on, but the wheels already came on. So. All right, so these snap on here. Let's get these put together. Just like that. Pretty simple. I don't know if the bottom's supposed to go in there, but we're going to do it. Um, as for the second shelf, I don't know at which position you should put it at, but I'm going to go ahead and do it, like line it up with the top one so it doesn't have any extra hooks or spaces. All right, and then we go ahead and put our sign on, but I'm actually going to put this on first. So we can either put this side or this side on, or you can put one on each side. I'm going to go ahead and use this chocolate one. I guess we could do both sides. I don't know. <laughs> May as well, I guess. All right. So what I mean is like this one. I guess this is candy. I was thinking that was carrots for some reason. I don't know why. <laughs> All right. So you could do this, something like that. Oops. I'm like knocking everything over now. And then you just go ahead and slide this on. So you can flip this, you know, take it back off and flip it. Then, sorry, I'm gonna move these over because I'm making a mess. Then we have these little price things. This is gonna be difficult to get on. Uh, you just put on the edges here. Let's see if I can do it. Okay, I kind of did it. It's kind of wonky, but you just do that with both of these. And then you'll have your stand, which is really great. I really like it. Oops. Although, is it just me or did we not get like a lot of candy? So <laughs> the candy sign doesn't really apply. <laughs> it's more like for season one that would work because we did get quite a bit of candy in that one. All right, so anyway, unless we just haven't gotten it yet. I don't know. Move on to the next one, maybe. There we go. I'm very curious if this is gonna have an accessory as well. We're technically missing one the paper bags, the sh regular shelves, and then the, like, the checkout counter. So we're still missing those ones. And there's a good chance that we'll be getting those. I think. In my opinion, anyway. Okay. This first one is the pickles. So let's just assume everything's going to be a duplicate. And we're going to kind of hope. Alright, so we got another one of the things we just built. So we got a duplicate of that. I'm just going to put it over off to the side. And let's see. I'm losing my capsules. All right. Next one, we have the blue diamond almond. So that's a duplicate for us. Um, all right. And then this one. Where's the strip? 
We got Miracle Whip again. And then, looks like we got Kraft Cheese Slice, not slices, shredded cheese again. All right, so that was fully duplicates. Duplicates? Duplicates. Let's see what's gonna be in this next one here. I'm very, I, so far they've all had, we have one, two, three, four, five. Did one not have an accessory in it? I think they all had accessories in it. I am not even paying attention, I guess. Most of them did anyway. Okay, this one. This one here. So we have blue diamond almond nut thins again. Yes, we did get this before. Then we have the Kool-Aid again. And we have the regular almonds again. Our shopping cart is full. Well, not full, full. It's not, it's not overflowing. Ooh, we got a new one. We got bacon, Oscar Mayer hard, hardwood smoked bacon. That's pretty cool. So this is kind of like a hard plastic, but like it's a very thin piece of plastic with like paper over it. It's pretty cool. I like it. Okay, what else? That one's open, this one's open, this one's not. <gasps> Ooh, okay, we're getting good stuff now. We're getting new stuff. We got the Velveeta shells and cheese. Mm, yummy. Although I don't really eat dairy, so I don't really eat them, but they look delicious. <laughs> All right, and then. Moving on. So we didn't get one in that one. We didn't get an accessory in that one. So that's good. You know, we want to keep it kind of more on the rare side, even though they were pretty common here on the second row. Okay. All right. So we got another one of those baskets with the handles. So I'm going to go ahead and whoop, try to collect all the pieces that I threw everywhere. Uh, and then let's open up the next capsule. <gasps> Jello! Oh my gosh, this is so. Uh, I guess I should have known from seeing it right there, but it's just so big in my hands. Like, there's no way a pack of Jello is that big. It'd be better if it were like maybe this size. This is still pretty cool. This is a really good size for like American Girl dolls or something like that. It's just a really good size. All right. Then we have the Velveeta again. Duplicate. And ooh. Ketchup! The Heinz tomato ketchup. Nice. That's awesome. Oh my goodness. Oh, I almost put that in the duplicate section. All right. I think we have one more and it's the Miracle Whip. So we'll put that in our shopping cart. All right. Let's see what's in the next one. So, so far, no matter what, we obviously have seen more of the accessories in the second row than we have in the first row. here we have this again another barbecue sauce what a different barbecue sauce looks like some things are falling out of our cart back there oh we got the paper bags oh my gosh those are so cute see i wouldn't mind getting a bunch of these you know these would be great for barbies and stuff they're just such a good size for dolls of that size and like even lol surprise like dolls like that Oh, I love it. You could easily fit like at least two groceries inside and of the smaller ones you could fit way more. These are awesome. My, those are definitely my favorite accessories and then you get two of them. That's so cool. Oh my gosh, that's amazing. I love it. So they are like actual paper too. You know, you can feel that they're paper bags. All right, so next one we got is the organic thyme seasoning from McCormick Gourmet. We haven't gotten this one, right? We got the paprika, but we didn't get the thyme. And then, what is this? Oh, this is the one that's right there on the display case. We haven't actually gotten this one yet, though. That's cool. So it's the feta cheese. Awesome. And then we have one more here. Whoop, that broke. What is this? Oh, it's the crystal light once again, so that is a duplicate. But still, such a good haul in that one. All right, we'll set that over to the side. And then this is our next one. Now we actually only have four capsules left after this one. So what a sad day. <laughs> we went through those so quickly. What well, it felt like really quickly anyway. And 
We got a duplicate Old Bay seasoning. We have more paper bags. So we got two more paper bags. That is a duplicate I do not mind seeing. And we got the crystal light again. I feel like the crystal light's really creeping up as a very common one for me. Uh, and then we have, I think this is the barbecue sauce. Yes. I think this is now winning as more common though. And then lastly, we have another duplicate, which is the crushed red pepper of the McCormick seasonings. All right, so moving on to the last row here. And we only have three left after this one. All right, so we are still missing two of the accessories. I'm still curious as to if we're gonna get those in here. I think this two, yeah, the regular shelves that we kind of saw in last season and the checkout counter. All right, let's see. All right, we got another one of those carts. That's a duplicate. And then we got the nut thins. I keep wanting to say neutral thins every time I see those. Then we have ground cinnamon. And then, ooh, is this one new? I think this one might be new. Yes, it's the Craft Thousand Island dressing. Nice. Oh my gosh. I can't wait to check the checklist and see which ones we're missing and which ones we need. I feel like we have a majority of the collection, but at the same time, once I check them all off, I'm be like, I'm still missing more than half. <laughs> so here is the stovetop chicken one that is a duplicate for us. All right, moving on. And this one's coming open very slowly. It's like you gotta open it slow because it's one of the last ones. But like I also really want to just get it open and see what comes we're gonna get. We haven't gotten like a rare one or a special one in a, in a while. We were on a roll there for like three caps. <laughs> Alright. We got a Country Time Lemonade. We have the almonds again. We have, is this the Thousand Island? Nope, Zesty Italian. Oh, ooh, new one! Philadelphia cream cheese, the original cream cheese. I didn't even know that one was on the checklist. Oh my goodness, that's so exciting. And then we got the new nut thins. I almost said Nutri Thins again. <laughs> All right, two more capsules, you guys, just two more. I cannot believe this. I cannot believe it. All right, here we go. Here we go. Where is the tear strip? Here it is. do we have in this capsule? We have, I think, yeah, this is the basket with the handle, so we got another one of those. So we have been seeing a lot of duplicates with the accessories, especially in the second row. This one is not coming open, so I'm gonna, you know, stab it a little bit there. Be careful if you decide to do that. <gasps> Ooh, we got the, a duplicate of these. I'm excited though, because I really like those ones. Let's see what else we have. Another Miracle Whip. I feel like we've gotten quite a few of those recently. And then another of the cream cheese. And this looks like it's gonna be an accessory, so I'm gonna give it off of this section real quick. And, oh no, it's not, it just has a checklist in it. Silly me. So we have the feta cheese once again. All right, you guys, this is the last capsule. Take a look, this is it. I'm hopefully gonna be able to do more videos of these. I would really like to do like maybe a 100 capsules opening like I did with LOL Surprises when I reached 100,000 subscribers. Or well, you know, I think it was 100. I opened 100 of them. It'd be cool to open 100 of these. <laughs> Give this video a thumbs up if you wanna see something like that. That'd be cool. All right, and then let's recut this because I didn't open properly. All right. This is it, you guys, this is it. Let's enjoy it while it lasts. Last, last layer of plastic. All right, and here we go. Okay, first one is the duplicate. It is the shopping cart. 
the next one is a duplicate. It is the Relish. The next one is, looks like a duplicate. Yep, the Stuffing Mix. The next one is another dressing, the Zesty Italian. Oh, come on, new one. Please be a new one. Ah, no, it's a duplicate, but the last one we got is the Crushed Red Pepper Seasoning. All right, you guys, as you can see, this is our shopping cart full of duplicates. It is pretty much full to the top. I love this shopping cart. I've raved about it before. I think it's a perfect size for the mini brands. Yeah, we get these cool little plastic ones, but if you want to hold a lot of them, this kind of shopping cart's amazing. But as you can see down here are all of the new ones that we have collected from series two thus far. I think, oh gosh, my favorite is probably still going to be the little Kool-Aid. Oh, but there's so many awesome ones. I'm really excited for the little Cool Whip and the ground cinnamon and the fries. The fries are so awesome. There's just so many cool ones and I cannot wait to collect this whole series and do more videos on this. Make sure you guys give this video a thumbs up if you are interested in seeing more videos like this. But anyway, guys, make sure you go check out my other YouTube channels. I have O'Cluck Games, which is my gaming channel, Carolina Wild Harvests, which is my gardening channel, and O'Cluck, which is my vlog channel. I will be linking all of those down below. Make sure you stop by, check it out, leave some comments, subscribe. I'd love to have you guys over there. But thank you so much for watching this video. Be sure to subscribe, and I will see you next time.